All right, pictures from the field. Copper lock, doesn't look like anything is soldered in this particular piping installation, which is the sanitary drainage system. Does anybody know by definition what they're looking at in this picture? So there's a trap with a Desenko on it. Here's your trap. Here's the weir of the trap. It's going up to probably a fixture because it's a trap. This would be defined as the trap on my fixture drain. Trap weir, top of the dip, how a trap seal is measured. Is a trap seal measured from down here to right here? Is that a trap seal? We are seeing these two pieces go in. Trap seal is measured from the weir, which is right there. That is the weir of your trap to the top of the dip. That is your measurement for a trap seal. If we would like to draw that in there, no solder here at all. Copper lock painted on with an acid brush. Got approved um, probably at this point 20 years ago. Bunch of people using it these days. Some people not using it. I still remember the meeting that I was part of the plumbing board that they introduced it. That stuff seals copper up to like 2000 PSI. But copper lock, trying to get away from soldering. Can't use white metal gem nuts on anything. You're using brass. So there's a lot of good stuff shown there. Water hammer arrester back there for the dishwasher machine that was in there. And clean out, part of a clean out. Water safety shutoff valve for a water treatment device back there. Too much water flows through that black device you see behind the copper automatically shuts off the water just simply by the rate of flow.